good morning or a good night depending on the time that you're listening to this um i want to give a small disclaimer here this entire series um is meant to be very off-putting it's meant to be very creepy it's purposely made to make you feel uncomfortable i know that on my channel i often make a lot of very comforting very soft very welcoming and sometimes very emotional based audios but for this series i've been trying to capture this very dark and very uncomfortable feeling and i would just like to give you a warning before you get into this audio is that this is not simply a yandere story where the guy kidnaps you but he's secretly sweet to you this is meant to be as off-putting as can be and is meant to make you feel like something is wrong and i just want to give you the feeling of <laughs> Please just be mindful of this as you get into the audio. I'm not going to keep this too long, so um, good luck and enjoy. You know, princess, I, uh, I appreciate that you leave your window open for me every night, but some days I wonder it would be better if you just lock it, you know? You are so gorgeous. I wish I can be this close to you every single day. But I need to resist. I need to wait. Soon, soon. so beautiful mm, looking down at you sleeping like this you look so vulnerable I can just do whatever I want to you I can have my way with you You see, the thing is, princess, I'm in love with you, and I've been watching you for so long, I've been by your side for so long, and sometimes it feels like you don't even know who I am, and it sickens me. But soon, soon, my love, I'll have you all to myself. Soon, you can lay your head on my chest, and you, you can fall asleep in my arms, my love. Just the two of us, no one else but me. 
and you. Just the two of us. But I see you every day. Every single day. You're talking to him. That boy is not me. He takes your attention away from me. In that whore you call the best friend. She fills your head with these disgusting lies. And they're keeping us apart. My love. They're keeping us apart. I hate that this is the only way I can get to speak to you. <laughs> I want you to look at me when we speak. I want to hear your voice when we speak. Oh, shh. shh. No, 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 calm down, my love. You can't wake up. No, no, no. There, there. You like when you... <laughs> you like it when I play with your hair when you sleep, right? Don't worry, soon enough. I'll do this for you every night. Is it comforting? Hearing my voice? Do you enjoy it? Feeling my fingers run through your hair? Shh. Get some rest, my love, okay? I promise you. I'll fix it. I'll make sure nothing get between us. Ever again. Okay? Just wait. I promise you. Just give me some more time. We will be together. I promise. Hey, 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 wait up, wait up, hey, hey, uh, good morning, hi, um, sorry, uh, I, I know that you two are friends, so, I, I thought I'd let you know, um, you know Lucas from our class? Yeah, you're the guy that you talk to, yeah, um, I just got news that, Today, he was riding to school and this random guy attacked him. Yeah, he's, he's hospitalized right now. He was beaten pretty badly. I just thought I'd let you know. Uh, well, the teacher told me that he was riding to school, but he passed through the park route instead of the main road. And he was attacked off of his bike. Somebody took something and brutally beat him with it. They broke both his arms and his legs. He's suffering with a concussion. His ribs are broken. His face is beaten to a pulp. They say that he's lucky to be alive. Hey, 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 wait, wait, hey. Don't cry. Hold on. Oh, I'm here. Let me hug you. Come. It's okay. It's okay. You can... I know. I am I feel bad for him as well. It's a terrible news to hear. No, it's it's okay. Just here. Here, lean into me. I have you. You're safe now, princess. I promise. Nothing's gonna happen to you. You're safe. Uh, there, there. Um... Is it okay if I run my fingers through your hair? Yeah. I know that's comforting. There, there. 
There, there. It's it's gonna be okay. I promise. Hey, hey. Oh, take care. Oh, are you okay? You. You feel extremely weak. Here. Lean close into my chest. Yeah, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay, okay? Listen. Listen. It's gonna be okay. Calm down. There you go. There you go. Listen to my voice. Feel my warmth. Feel my arms wrapped around you. Feel my fingers softly play with your hair. Now calm down. You're gonna be okay. I promise you. You're gonna be okay. Hey, hey, hey. If you need, after school, I can walk with you to the hospital. And you can go and check up on him, okay? We can stop by the flower store and you can buy a couple of flowers for him, okay? Yeah. It's gonna be okay. I'm here for you. You're not alone. You don't have to go through this alone, okay? Good girl. You're safe now. You're safe with me. I promise, I will never let anything or anyone hurt you, ever, okay? Good girl, I have you, you're safe, you're safe, you're safe when you're with me, and I'll be by your side, no matter what. Forever always. Why, hello there, baby boost. Hi. Um, it's been a while since I've felt better. I'm actually not feeling better. I'm just not feeling weak. Um, My anxiety isn't any better. I, I I promise not to like worry you guys. Um, it, it's nothing to do with work or with anything really. I I just something. A lot just has been happening and it's taking me a lot longer to adjust to all of it <sighs> all right so um continuing this storyline i hope i delivered this as well as i wanted to like, I have the idea in my head, I have, like, the general gist of it, I have, like, the thought of what I want to do. I'm thinking of adding music to the beginning of it, maybe, but I'm not sure because I want it to be unsettling, but I don't want it to be forced unsettling. I don't want it to be scary, you know? I want it to be creepy and unsettling, unnerving is what I'm trying to say, but I don't want it to be scary to the point where it's just it's just horror bait right so i'm not sure i doubt i doubt i will but i might i might play around with it and if i find it it sets the tone of what i want or if i can find a song that sets the tone i might use it but if i can't then um i'll just post it as is um yeah uh-huh Oh, today, um, I, I'm not sure. Hold on, give me, give me a second. Okay, so normally, I would cut that little piece of break out there. Ooh, I, I hit the mic by mistake. 
But because I asked you to give me a second, I will leave the piece of break in right there because I am a dork like that. And I like continuity like that. So there's a pause there for no no reason whatsoever. Um, but a while back, um, I made a tweet about my parents asking me to lie. And there was a situation where my sister wanted to get me a hamper for Christmas. And I told her that I am... Uh, I am not well off, but I can take care of myself for Christmas. The hamper that they are giving out are for people who are in extreme need, for single parents, for people living in poverty, for people who actually can't afford to buy food this Christmas. And I don't think I am in a position to receive it. But... My sister had already signed me up for it, and there was no way around me receiving it. So I ended up having to lie to, to make sure I get it. And it bothered me a lot, and it bothered me quite a lot that I had to do such a thing. But I spoke with my sister, and I spoke with my parents, and I got them to agree that I will collect it. But I will be giving it off to a needy family. And today, we got the hamper. And we sorted out the stuff. And we got a lot of like the personal supplies. I think I took um, one or two things like a towel. Because I'm a guy and I only own two towels. One of them, I can't even remember where I put it down. And the other one I've been using for like two weeks now. <laughs> so yeah, and we split the stuff up to give to my neighbor's kid so that she can get some personal supplies. And then we gave like some of the grocery stuff to one of the um, uh, immigrant workers that had worked for us. And there's a single mom that lives like three houses down, four houses down. We gave her the gift card to go and make a small shopping for Christmas. It's not much. I, I guess it will relate to around. Should I say the price is saying the price? I mean, it's whatever. It's, it, 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 it relates around to about 100 US dollars, right? Give or take currency differences. And normally I separate myself from such things i i don't like the spotlight i don't like i don't know it's it's weird but today my mom begged me to go with her to to deliver it and my mom knows that i'm not a fan of the spotlight because she loves the spotlight so it, it, it was like a bittersweet thing and she said that this was from me and my mom and she gave the lady the card. And she genuinely, genuinely looked surprised, baffled, happy even. She was shocked for words and I don't know, it just hit me in a feeling that I wasn't used to. Seeing her happy was just nice. I can't say I felt proud or I even felt happy because I don't know. But in the in the in the in the split seconds that I saw her smile, I was glad I made the decision. I don't really know why I told you guys that I guess it's just been on my mind and kind of wanted to share it with someone and you guys are the people that I have to share my thoughts and feelings with so I'm sharing it with you guys so happy holidays everyone <laughs> right um 
Do you know that 75% of the people listening to this right now are not subscribed to me? If you've made it this far for whatever godforsaken reason listening to me ramble for 7 minutes after the, after the audio already ended, please leave a like and a comment down below. Um, I This is another thing I wanted to rant about but I'll make a let's talk about it. I already posted a video on a video link to it but it's something I want to talk about as well. So I'll post a let's talk about it eventually. Probably on my second channel, maybe. Maybe I, yeah, I may record the let's talk about it tonight and post it on my second channel, I don't know. But yeah, it's something I want to talk about. Leave a like and a comment down below. As for your subscription, I'll be playing you in a friendly game of rock, paper, scissors. The rules are simple. I will go rock, paper, scissors, and then shoot upon shoot on and on so they went. And if I've won, you're not obligated to subscribe to me. If I've lost, you're not obligated to go down in the comment section and let me know. If it's a draw, you're not obligated to meet me here tomorrow to play again. And if I've beaten you two times in a row, you're not obligated to put on the notification button down below. Alright, let's go. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Today I went paper. That means if you went scissors, you just won. But if you went rock, you just lost. And keep in mind, if I've beaten you three times in a row, you now belong to me, mind, body, and soul. Yeah, that's a. I try to think of a of a of a supernatural being, but I couldn't think of one that ties into me owning you. So just know I own you now. That's 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 all. <laughs> okay, guys, remember to keep healthy. Eat two to three times a day, or six times a day in small healthy amounts. Remember to keep hydrated. Water is great. Juice is good. Soda is fine as long as you water it down or put a lot of ice. Remember to keep active. Keeping active keeps you healthy. Remember to get at least some sunlight because it helps keep the pressure away. And remember, each and every single one of you are the most beautiful people in the entire world. But you are most gorgeous when you smile. So never stop smiling. Alright guys. Happy holidays. Best to you and your family. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, bye bye